This video will guide you through the procedure of using Toby glasses for the first time. The packaging contains the following items. A pair of glasses, a recording assistant, IR markers for calibration, chargers, and spare batteries. The glasses feature a scene camera for recording what the participant sees and a microphone for recordings. The lenses of the glasses have a special coating which always needs to be kept clean since the IR reflex of glass is very sensitive to smudges, dirt, and scratches. Before you start, please make sure that the batteries and IR markers are charged. Carefully insert the SD card, then connect the recording unit to the glasses. Turn it on by pressing the on-off button. Please make sure that both date and time are set correctly. You can change date and time in the date and time dialog in the settings menu. Instruct the participant on how to put the glasses on carefully, and as the Toby glasses do not have hinges, only bend the black part. Make sure that the glasses are not loose and don't move around by tightening the head strap on the back and make sure there is no hair in front of the scene camera. A new empty session is created automatically when the recording assistant is started. For the eye tracker to work, it must be properly calibrated. The calibration can be done either before or after the study. In order to calibrate, the participant has to be positioned exactly one meter from a flat, neutral surface, such as a solid colored wall. Ask the participant to look straight ahead and hold his or her head as still as possible. Then, press the Calibrate button on the Recording Assistant. Once the pupil is found, it will be indicated by a green dot on the Recording Assistant screen in an image of the glasses. Press Continue to start the calibration. A representation of a 9-point calibration grid will be displayed on the screen. Hold an IR marker against the flat surface at which the participant is looking. Ask the participant to look continuously at the green indicator light on the IR marker, keeping his or her head still throughout the entire process. On the recording assistant screen, the IR marker shows up on the calibration grid as a blinking dot. Watch the recording assistant screen while moving the IR marker slowly over each calibration point. Wait until a point turns green before continuing to the next. Press Accept after all points have turned green. To initiate the recording process, press the Record Pause button on the Recording Assistant. The screen will display the detected pupil as a dot within the image of the glasses once again. Press Continue to start the recording. The Toby Glasses Eye Tracker is now recording the participant's gaze along with scene video and audio. During the recording, the Recording Assistant shows real-time information on the participant's trackability. Once the recording is done, press the Record Pause button to stop. Then, press Stop and Save to end the session and save the data onto the SD card. To record the next participant, create a new session by pressing the New button. Please note that every new participant needs to be calibrated separately. Always turn the recording assistant off before removing the SD card. Once all participants have been tested, remove the SD card and insert it into your computer. Close any autoplay dialog boxes that appear and start Toby Studio. In Toby Studio, create a new project. From Toby Studio's menu bar, select File and select Import Glasses Data. Select the SD card labeled Glasses. Open the Project folder and select the project.gpf file. Choose the recordings you wish to import by checking or unchecking the respective checkboxes. Click on Play to watch the recording. For more information on functionality and features, please refer to the included manual. 